Hey what's up guys welcome to another video in which we are going to write python program to add arrays using the map function so guys let us move to the vs code over here in order to write this python program so basically we are going to have two list over here that is list 1 it is equal to we will have the numbers that is 1 2 3 and then 4 and then let's say we have another list that is list 2 so again we are going to have some array of numbers over here let's say we have 5 6 7 and then 8 now guys let's say we want to add both these arrays that is both these lists so the first element that is 1 should be added to the first element in the second list that is 5 so the result should be 6 and then 2 plus 6 the result should be 8 and so on the corresponding indices in both these lists should be added in order Order to find the result list over here so guys we can simply achieve this task by using the map function so over here what we can do is we can have the map function and the first parameter will be the function in this case that will be executed by this map function so over here let's say we provide the anonymous function that is lambda over here it will take two numbers that is one number from list one and then another number from list two over here so we have x and then comma y in this case which will be the two numbers from both the list and then after this we have colon and simply we can do x plus y over here so this is the result that will be returned from this map function now guys the second parameter that we need to provide is the list over here so second parameter will be list one and another parameter will be list two from where these values will be taken into x and y so guys over here we will provide list one as the second parameter and then the third parameter will be list two so guys basically the first parameter parameter will be the function over here we have defined the anonymous function inside the map function and after the first parameter inside the map function we have all the iterables that is list 1 and list 2 from where the data will be coming now guys these results needs to be stored in a particular variable so what we will be doing is we have the map result over here so we have map underscore result so all these results that is 1 plus 5 which is equal to 6 it will be stored in this map result then we have 2 plus 6 3 plus 7 4 plus 8 so all the results will be stored inside the map result over here then guys simply what we can do is print this map result so while printing the map result we need to convert it into the list so over here we will simply have the list function and then we can simply provide the map result variable so let me just copy this and paste this over here so guys this is the way that we can add all the elements from list 1 and list 2 and display the results on the console so let me just save this file now and try running this code in order to confirm the same as you can see the first element we are getting 6 which is 1 plus 5 which is equal to 6 then 2 plus 6 it is equal to 8 then 3 plus 7 is 10 and then 4 plus 8 it is equal to 12 guys you can also achieve the same task by using the for loop and adding each element from both the list one at a time and storing it in a third list variable so that is another way that you can try out as a homework for you but this map function helps you in order to write very less number of code and to achieve the required task by providing the iterables and the required function which is having the required expression over here so guys please try Practice on your own so that on different inputs you get different outputs. Make sure that you like this video so that it reaches to more people and subscribe to this channel so that you get the notifications on upcoming videos as well. The next video that we are going to talk about is Python program to find even numbers in the list using the filter function. So stay tuned.